Let's see how to do a one proportion z interval on our calculators. Let's see if there's a difference or calculate how large a difference there is between teens who are involved in social networking and adults who are involved in social networking. So to do this, we're going to hit stat, go over to test, and choose option six, two proportion z, oh not z test, hold on. Let's see if we can find it here. We want a two proportion z interval that would be option B. And we need to make sure we're entering a whole number here for the number of successes. If you enter a decimal value, your calculator is going to give you an error message. So for the teens, we had 584 out of the 800 that answered yes to the survey about being involved in social networking. And for the males, one, or for the adults, not necessarily the males, but the adults, 1,059 out of 2,253. And let's do a 95% confidence interval. And then we go down to calculate. And that's how you do a confidence interval on the TI-84. Notice the width of this interval is fairly small, and that's because our sample size for the adults especially was very large.